Hi, Michelle Boyle here with Boyle & Point Contender, and I wanted to introduce you to the brand new 23 Bay that we have added to the Contender fleet. We just got one in here, and I'm excited to show you around. Though the smallest model in the Contender fleet, the 23 Bay is big on performance. It'll run 65 miles an hour with a single 300, and with its 80 gallons of fuel capacity, you'll have a range of over 350 miles on a bay boat. On this 23 Bay, you'll see this beautiful stainless steel rub rail, which is really neat because it comes with the inset nav lights right here and on the starboard side. We've got an ice blue whole side, an ice blue bottom, and then the cap and the liner and the console are all beautiful white. All right, so I'm up here on this huge casting platform on the 23 Bay. It is so nice to just be able to easily step up here. Got plenty of room for casting. You're gonna see an anchor locker with molded in anchor storage, which is super nice and clean looking. And you're gonna see much larger casting deck on the 23 Bay. This boat is really designed to fish hard and you will see that in the details. This huge 75 gallon locker, plenty of storage for all of your life jackets, line, whatever you need, uh, bucket, anything like that. This you'll see is the leaning post. This is a really nice custom leaning post that is maximal fishability. You can take this out and you have all of these rod holders here and totally get this out of your way if you want to, but super, super comfortable. As you can see, plenty of space for everyone while you ride out in this bay boat. Um, you're gonna see oversized in-deck bilge access on the 23 Bay. We really worked hard to improve that bilge access and you'll see how well it came out. We've got a 35 gallon live well and you've also got an aft casting deck with ample room between the deck and the leaning post. And lastly, we've got the heavy duty jack plate with the blinker style control on the steering wheel so you can use it and be running hard in shallow skinny water and it's right there on your steering wheel to get that jack plate and get that prop a little farther out of the water. You'll see inside of this locker that there's actually some decent rod storage in here. So you've got a little rod rack and then we've got a chute mounted in there so the rod can go straight through. So if you've got long spinners, they should still fit just fine. And you've got that in both of these lockers. And then here is a huge forward fish box. And that is amazing amount of room. You could just have a killer day filling that up. So on this bay boat, you know, we've got no T-top, so we do lose out on a little bit of rod storage there. So we went ahead and put rod holders on each port and the starboard side of the console. You've got four on each, eight extra rod holders. A great spot for your gear, or if you want to use it as a cooler, is this seat right here. Um, definitely maximizes on its footprint. So it can be used as dry storage, it can be used as a cooler, and it's awesome. Very, very comfortable seating. Obviously you can fit two people right out. So you can see this dash is really a nice looking dash. We've got the blackout acrylic um, dash with the Garmin screen mounted into it. And then you've got this beautiful black Edson steering wheel, just turned out super sharp. On this 23 Bay, we went ahead and installed the new Garmin Kraken trolling motor. It is a 63 inch shaft and it holds this baby on a dime. Gonna see great access in this boat, power pole charging control system. And then you'll see the bilge access is really impressive for this size boat. Plenty of room for you to move around if you need to and get in there. So you're gonna see on the back of this beautiful 23 Bay, we've got two white shallow water anchors, power poles, um, super nice pulling up to the sandbar with ease, um, pulling up to the fish quietly and getting on the spot. You also have got the Bob's Machine jack plate, super nice for the skinny water. And then you'll see a Gerlich ladder built into the transom, easily can pull that out and jump on in from the water. This 23 Bay is perfectly paired with a Mercury 300 V8. Um, overall, the 23 Bay, the length is 23.8, the beam is 8.4, the weight is about 4,500 pounds, but that is loaded. And we've got 80 gallon fuel capacity, a dead rise of 15.5, maximum horsepower 350, and the water, we've got fresh water at 15 gallons.